Hello friend. In our previous tutorial, we have learned how to create fountain with gravity. Now in this tutorial, we will learn how to create fountain with Newton. Uh, in this tutorial, I will uh, make the fountain all around this uh, area with the curve. So ready to start. First, uh, I will select this fountain dish and then uh, click on this snap to point thereafter go in create menu and select curve tool cv curve tool now i will start to create curve one two two three sorry four five six seven eight press the enter button here is some problem delete this extra point okay so we have uh, now a curve with uh, eight point so first select this curve thereafter go in fx is the fx and then go to n particle click emit from object uh, i will just reset it emitter type should be directional particle rate uh, should be 1500 speed should be 15 this period 0.02 and then create ok now play ok as you are seeing uh, particle is uh, creating with the 8 point but in x direction so first we will change the direction select this particle and uh, go to emitter here you can see direction is x so this 0 1 now play again okay we get we we are getting this error message nucleus evaluation is skipped because this is the due to <coughs> time frame so go in preferences here you can get the preferences button click on this and uh, in the category there is a time slider then go in playback here you can see 24 fps into one change it to play every frame save now now play again okay so fountain and now creating uh, from the eight point but uh, we have to edit some uh, uh, some option so first select this particle and uh, increase the speed first okay so now this uh, particle is uh, long than this uh, center particle again select this particle and then go to end particle shape and i will change its uh, lap span mode life forever to random range then play increase its more number three because particle will uh, fall onto the ground so lap spam random 1.5 uh, it's okay 
now select this particle and go to in particle shape uh, i will change its uh, shape so go in uh, shading change point to a strip now it's converted to a strip click on color option now you will change its color so go in uh, here you can see the color option i will change first the color to green and second color will be others okay so we have now two colors oh, sorry we have now uh, two colors but uh, in the viewport uh, we are only seeing one color so we have uh, to change some uh, option like uh, color and put change to speed and increase color randomize now play again okay so both color are visible now we are thinking that uh, this uh, outside uh, waterfall will uh, go the center on this uh, fountain so what will will do uh, select this fountain then go to field and solver here you can find the option field and solver and we will choose new turn click click this option box and uh, just create now if we play nothing and change so we have to change it manually uh, you can find the Newton option here Newton field just sorry just select this Newton field and go its attribute editor here you can see the magnitude at animus and minimum distance uh, we will make this zero and we will play together so we can see the result and then increase the magnitude value Give it one. Change its value to fifty and zero point eight. I think we should uh, increase the value of speed. So select this particle and uh, go in a, a meter and uh, here you can see speed so just play this and increase the value now it's cool if it's going outside you can uh, decrease the value of its lifespan so go in uh, in shape particle and uh, here you can see 2.5 Two point five is uh, okay, but I'll increase some more. Two point six, okay. So this is the our tutorial uh, fountain with uh, Newton. Now, if you want the both uh, particle does not emit at the same time. Uh, as you are seeing that uh, both particle emitting from the time of zero 
so you can uh, change the uh, time so select this uh, particle and go to nucleus here you can see nucleus and go below here you can see the time attribute and start frame is 1 I will increase its value to 250 now play again here you can go now both particles will not start together first it will then after outside you can increase the number of this uh, particle because uh, it is not clearly visible after the outer particle start emitting so select this and uh, go to emitter uh, here is the 3500 I will increase it to 7000 now play again here you can this is the good it is looking good ok friends so hope you will uh, like my tutorial if you liked please uh, press the like button and please subscribe my button uh, subscribe my youtube channel thank you